Siemens is contributing to solutions for charging stations in the e segment because cities are growing. Infrastructure and public transport has to grow alongside them. At the same time, conventional vehicles result in more emissions, such as CO2. The e is a green, emission-free alternative. In order for it ride continuously and without limitations, Siemens is offering charging technology solutions. Siemens is offering different kinds of charging infrastructures, off-board, on-board and depot charging. The reason is that cities are different, for example with regard to road infrastructure, meters in height which needs to be passed, road conditions, available space for charging stations, catenary present or not, etc. Depending on the requirements, the best suitable solution can be selected. While plug-in charging is mostly available at the depots, the operation of the buses can be also ensured by charging them at the final stops for short periods. This keeps the range of the buses at sufficient levels until the next final stop has been reached. As a technology company, Siemens is well aware of the phenomenon that buying solutions from one provider does result in the creation of isolated applications. We are therefore focusing on interoperability, meaning that through the utilization of open standards, every vehicle brand is compatible with the Siemens charging infrastructure. Our world premiere of this took place on Hamburg's Route 109, where Volvo and Solaris buses were charged with the same charging infrastructure. We already have quite a few cities and applications where e-buses are already being utilized together with Siemens charging technology. Off-board charging is in operation in Montreal, for example. Furthermore, we have onboard charging via Catenary in Vienna. And DC plug-in charging is in use at the airports in Stuttgart and Geneva for transit traffic.